Entoptic Hopscotch, The Mind Game, by Rodney Stewart Adams. Here we go again. These are the, the entoptics. An entoptic is a pattern that we see in our minds. These entoptics relate to different brain areas, different dimensions, and have got different meanings. So this is essentially a game of meaning, of meaningful relationships, of using your imagination of using your mind, of using the other 90%. So these are the entoptics, the patterns that we see in our minds. Breast, a tunnel, face, a wave, a grid, uh, stars, spirals, Widdish in spirals, flames, zigzags, and uh, the clockwise spiral. So these are the numbers. The number zero is a breast, a circle with a point. So in our minds, in every situation, there's a point. What's the point of this? The point of this is to use your mind, to use your imagination. So you get an original point, and you know, in the physical world, that can be moving an object to a certain point. Or in a conversation, it can be getting to the point. Uh, moving in and out of focus, we get a circle. The point in the circle gives us the breast, which is an entoptic. When that point moves, we get a line. So there's no dimensions. W one dimension is a line. If you see that entoptic moving, you get a tunnel a tunnel which people see you know as a near-death experience when they turned off and go back to a point point. and then next you get the face when we look at any black surface we always see a face we can always see eyes and a face so we see this pattern of faces in our minds and then we have the, the third dimension the face is a surface, a plane, the second dimension. Onto the third dimension, we have a wave, which is a ripples entoptic or a wave entoptic. And then we have a clock, the four, a clock, the hands of the clock, which is a grid or a checkerboard entoptic, the chessboard entoptic, any pattern of grids and squares. And then five is an eye, and th there we see the rays entoptic, which is seeing stars, we see a central star. And then six, the Wittgenstein spiral, the ascent spiral, is pressure, the sense of touch. Here we have the zigzag, which is an object, you know, shape. And that is the sense of taste. Then we have the flames, the flame entoptic sea in flames, you know, the passions. And there we have the clockwise entoptic, the nine, which is G, which is gravity. So the, so the numbers, the shapes of the numbers are the entoptics. And the entoptics refer to different brain areas. And these are root meanings in our minds, in our understanding. So we see there at five the eye, and the eye can see the point. Then the eye is attracted by any movement. So this is to do with moving. This is seeing the speed, judging speed. Here, it's seeing face, recognizing faces. 
So for a child, the child sees the mother's breast and it moves to the mother's breast and then it sees the mother's face. So a device sees the breast or sees the signal entoptic, follows the movement and can recognize a face to be trained or as a partner. The, the wave entoptic, you know, ripples is to do with space. And the clock, obviously the fourth dimension is the time, fifth dimension is the eye, the sixth dimension is touch, the seventh is the object relations. Now, when the point moves, it seems to move on a surface. When the wave then becomes an object which we identify through taste so we identify a space through smell and an object through taste and then we go to the heat which is the flame which is to do with our gender boy or girl and then nine is gravity the position we're in in our posture you know, the actual position or actual orientation. So all of these entoptics have meanings. And there are 64 steps in the game entoptic hopscotch. In, in the game of entoptic hopscotch, we hop from one step to another to get a narrative, to tell a story, you know, to understand the situation. So this is model can be used in in many different situations but first of all we must understand the 64 steps before we go on to understand in the game so obviously it's going to take a while to go through the 64 steps I'm just introducing the beginnings of the game the different brain areas the different entoptics And now these entoptics, you know, rule our minds. So, for example, we have breast on page three, so we're brainwashed by the politics on page two. We see this tunnel as a near-death experience, you know, going down tunnels of fear, going down the pan. His face is in the darkness. There's the wave, we're waiting for the wave. We're, you know, there's smelling, you know, seeking. This time and hearing the grid, the rigid structure. Here we have the, the, the central self, you know, the seeing, the one who's seeing all this going on around him. And then here we have in touch, you know, to do with um, plant life, you know, surface tension. And here we have objects, our object relations. Right. Time's up. Right, sorry, 